Assalamu alaikum, this is Dr. Hasna and today we'll study the medial bone of the forearm known as ulna. We have already studied radius. Now let's begin with an overview of the ulna. The ulna has an upper end, a shaft and a lower end. The upper end has two processes, the olecranon and coronoid process. The shaft has three borders, dividing it into three surfaces and finally the lower end which is the head of the ulna carrying the styloid process. And now let's start with the side determination. Which side ulna is this? So to know the side, we should always first start with knowing what is the upper end and what is the lower end. So the upper end of the ulna is basically hook-like. So you know that this is hook-like upper end with its concavity directed forwards. Hence, this is the anterior side of the ulna. And the second point is that the lower end is basically consisting of the head and the styloid process and the styloid process lies posteromedially, meaning back and medial side. So you know that this is the medial side and this is the lateral side. And the third most important point is that the lateral border is the sharpest border. You know, if we hold it like this, we know if this is lateral border, then this is basically the ulna of the right forearm. So this was the side determination of the ulna. Let's, uh, let me give you an overview. The upper end is hook-like with its concavity directed forwards. The lower end is basically containing the styroid process, which is lying posteromedially. And finally, the most prominent border or the sharpest border, crest-like border is the lateral border of the bone. So these are three points in side determination.